See, in that true converter pattern, I just converted it, and I said, oh, this is stepped inductor, and I have this capacitor, and I now in a, uh, move diode direction in opposite direction, and this is chuk back 2. No, it's not. Chuk back 2 is when you actually include this transformer, or auto transformer, has a leakage inductance which you can't get rid of. It's always there. And that's a key point. Remember how I emphasized all present switching converters have a problem because they don't know what to do with that leakage inductance because like leakage inductance in a flyback transformer causes all the losses and, and that's limitation. You cannot go to high frequency and so on. Now, I actually put leakage inductance here and what this purpose is that this leakage inductance with this capacitance creates a resonance, okay? And that resonance is such that you'll see that, that there is continuous change of this, so there is no energy lost in this leakage inductance. And the reason why is a little bit more complicated. We'll, uh, we'll have to go and study some of the things that I published and so on. But basically, it, it uh, really acts like these two for, for uh, this period of time here. It looks like this is a short, and then you have a resonance here. And this resonance is just LRCR. And remember what I said about uh, uh, when you have a, a hybrid switching. This resonance is only during the off time period. It's limited to off time period. And it's not, so therefore, that forces the, the so in any way, let's, let's last now first demonstrate it. So it's a simulation. Start. Beautiful. Have you seen any simulation which gives you in milliseconds, you know, 15 different waveforms and they're all correct and there are no problems with, <laughs> with the, uh, how you say, um, uh, convergence problems and no accuracy problem, etc. So what are these waveforms? So let me, let me now show you what these waveforms are. And remember, I promised to tell you that eventually I'm going to put this new type of a magnetic structure, which I call this <coughs> hybrid transformer. This is the next close approximation to Faraday transformer. My Chuk converter with isolation transformer had a square wave voltages and square wave current. Faraday transformer has a sine wave voltage and sine wave current. What does this have? This has a square wave voltages driving this, but what are these three, uh, let me put it out, out. what is this uh, current in, uh, in uh, red? Yeah, it's, um, you see the red current? That is this current in the primary. And do you see where it's, uh, and let's, let's put some more uh, values so you can see it. So let me uh, just put uh, U. And uh, show cursors. I put a cursor, and uh, then I can measure from here. And in fact, I think we can measure from here to here. I'm putting cursors during off interval.